West Kill Valley, only two and a half hours from New York City, is a pristine world apart of streams and waterfalls surrounded by the New York State Forest Preserve. 30 minutes from Wyndham, Hunter and Bel Air, with their well-known restaurants, art galleries, shopping and craft fairs, the area is blessed with 12 golf courses, two tennis and racquetball clubs, tubing from Phoenicia, two-season hunting and world-class fly fishing, plus riding and biking on the New York State Trail System in the Catskill Park. West Kill Valley runs east to west along the West Kill Stream. From the charming village of West Kill, the road runs seven miles to the New York State Trail System at the base of Hunter Mountain. An easy one-mile walk along the trail leads to one of the area's many beautiful waterfalls. Leading up from the West Kill Stream, the road arrives at the entrance to Spruceton Valley Start Lodge and sweeping views of the entire valley below. Completely handcrafted, the lodge itself five years in the building by craftsmen from the Polish Alps is made from Native American Douglas fir, cedar, cherry, aspen, hickory and pine all crowned with hand-split cedar shakes. 90,000 board feet of Douglas fir go into walls made of two separate load-bearing components a 7-inch solid exterior wall and a 5-inch interior wall with 2 inches of double-sided insulation between them hand-fitted carved splines between every beam guarantee a solid structure perfectly protected from the elements. Large custom windows, set lower than usual, ensure full views of the valley from every room. Raised beds and tubs make it possible to enjoy the sunrise or the evening beauty of the surrounding countryside to the fullest extent. A radiant propane heating system on all levels, including both second floor porches, is zoned so that bathrooms may be kept warm while bedrooms remain cooler. Lighting, adjustable for various moods, uses daylight bulbs for real sun lighting throughout the house. Two music systems, one for the first and second floors and one for the basement complex, provide separate speakers and volume controls for each room. Italian ceramic tile covers the deck and those interior floors not made from custom-cut hickory. On entering the lodge, coats may be left in a foyer, across from which is a mudroom with a floor drain, useful for washing boots and dogs as well as storing skis and other outdoor gear. A small guest bathroom is located next to the entrance. The main room features a large dining table in front of French doors with views of the valley below. A large fireplace in the main room warms the house on cold nights. A separate office off the main room, wired for a satellite computer feed, features large picture windows and French doors for privacy. A custom kitchen with a sub-zero fridge and freezer, an extra-large dual-fueled range, gas and electric, with six burners and a grill with two ovens is perfect for preparing a romantic meal for two or a 20-person feast. The master bedroom suite on the main floor also has its own fireplace and doors to the deck for easy outdoor access in the summertime. The master bathroom has a dual therapy tub, a custom rain shower, aspen woodwork and cherry cabinets, plus great outdoor views. The upstairs master bedroom duplicates the lower, but has a unique shiatsu tub and opens onto a private heated balcony. A loft affording remarkable views is accessed by a carved staircase. On the second floor, there are two sitting areas and a second pine panel bedroom with its own soaking bubble bath. Stairs and railings made with hickory, cherry and fir exemplify the art of the house. An outdoor dining area with its own cooking fireplace, adjustable lighting and sound system is one of the great gifts of the house, allowing tranquil views undisturbed by other houses, roads or traffic noise. The lower level constitutes a full spa with a sunroom sitting area, a dipping lap pool and a fireplace for enjoying the sauna and steam rooms and two additional bedrooms with baths plus a changing area with a separate bathroom for guests, together with the laundry room. 
The water service area houses the lodge's filter system. The dual 200 amp electric service can be monitored in the electric service room, which also serves as a pantry and silver storage area. A large central area is designed as an entertainment room with a small kitchen for food and drink service to the spa. The second bedroom and bath is located by the basement's rear entrance, which is through a ramp with double steel doors. The house is a true work of art, with every detail from the cedar trim carvings to the hand-cut horse heads of every beam fitting in perfectly with the beauty of the valley, offering total privacy and security. Sited on 20 acres, the lodge abuts two 19-acre parcels bounded by stone walls and state forest. An additional 47-acre parcel has a large freshwater spring that feeds two small catch ponds. This parcel is bounded to the west by the schoolhouse brook, to the north by the state forest, and to the east by the two 19-acre parcels. Although all parcels have wonderful views, they are all mutually discreet.